Ever wondered how you can use our WebXR feature to create spatial websites? Well then this video is just for you. In this tutorial, we're going to build our first 3D website using Blender that you can also view in AR and VR using Needle Engine. I already set up a scene in Blender, which we will soon be able to view in our browser as well as in AR and VR. Make sure you install our Needle Engine add-on. If you haven't done that already and need help doing that, check out our Getting Started Guide for Blender. The link is in the video description. Now let's create an empty object and name it XR. Then we're going to open the Objects tab and scroll down to the Needle Components panel. Click Add Component. Now search for WebXR and click on it. And that's actually all you need to do to make your project WebXR ready. Now let's go back to the Scene tab and press Start Server. As you can see, it works perfectly fine in our browser. Now let's try it out in AR. Click the QR code button and scan it with your mobile device. Now that the website is open on your phone, click Enter AR. Place your scene by tapping on a fitting spot on your screen in your surroundings. I can view my scene from all angles. Awesome! Now let's see whether we can also view it in VR. We're going to open our scene again and click Open on Quest. It directs us to the MetaQuest website. Note that you have to be logged in into your account and that your quest has to be connected to this account. Now click Open. When putting on our quest, we see the quest browser popping up, showing us our website. Now click Enter VR. It's working! I am fully immersed in a scene that was just a simple Blender project a few moments ago. Awesome, right? So, what are you going to build with Needle Engine using WebXR? Let us know in the comments below. Feel free to check out our other tutorial videos as well. To learn more about Needle Engine, visit our website under needle.tools.